Hello all, I wanted to show you another interesting use case from our on-demand labs portal attackdefense.com. Now we've all downloaded and used vulnerable applications so we can exploit and learn from them. We really love these apps, uh, but the whole process of going ahead, installing them in a VM, configuring them correctly, reverting to old pristine snapshots once you've corrupted something is a very familiar painful experience, right? Now, not to mention the disk usage, especially if you want to run many of these vulnerable systems ready to use at all times. Now at attackdefense.com, we really understand this and we've tried to solve this problem. So let me show you how. Now here I have a very popular vulnerable application, damn vulnerable web application created by Ryan Dewhurst. Now, all it actually takes to launch this is hitting the run button, waiting for 10 to 15 seconds, and voila, you'll actually get a dedicated sandboxed instance of this application ready to use. So you see now we have the lab link. As soon as you click that, we end up getting this application made available to us uh, in a dynamically generated random subdomain to ensure that only you can access it. Now, one of the things we know is many a times you want to actually work with teams to go ahead and break applications and learn from them. So all you'd have to do is give this randomly generated URL to the rest of your team members and all of you can collaboratively work on this application. So you can log into this just like you would when you locally install it. And then you can set up the database, you can do all of that stuff. Most of it should actually be pre-installed. Now let's say that while playing with this application, you end up corrupting it in some way, right? Or you know, you've exploited it, you've put your web shell on it, you know, you've, <laughs> you've done everything, uh, and you now want a new instance to play. So all you'd have to do is basically hit stop. And this goes ahead and destroys that dynamically generated sandboxed uh, application. And this should also just take a few seconds. And once this is done, you could go back in here, you'd see that the app is no longer available and you can just hit the run button once again. And this should once again spin up a brand new version of this application so that you can play with it again. So if you notice, no more revert to snapshots and all of that, uh, extremely easy so that you as a student during your learning experience can completely focus on the learning and not have to worry about setting things up. So the good news, all existing Pentester Academy students can access this lab and others available on attackdefense.com from inside the Pentester Academy members area. If you're not a student, sign up for a free beta access which starts later this month. Thanks guys, I'm really excited and I hope to see you soon on attackdefense.com. Thank you.